there is a common question that i keep getting from folks asking about how to get the same for example you have seen previously like when you are calling a system api directly through postman you will see a proper response over here right this is the structured or customized response but in case uh, we are calling from another api like from process api or experience api how to fetch this uh, customized error message from system api to process api or from process to experience so it's very simple uh, if you debug the application you will get to know see i have an application already up and running here so here you can see i am using http requester to call my system api okay so here also i am just using the query parameters to pass so that uh, it will recreate the error for example 400 send i am sending the 400 status code so if i send here so here if i see here i will go next next it will create an error okay you can see my error type is bad request over here and if i resume i won't be finding any kind of error or you won't be finding the description if i send again you won't be finding that particular uh, error message proper error message anywhere over here but you can see it will always be present somewhere here around mule message okay can you see here mule message within mule message there is something called typed value and within typed value you can see there is a value this is where you can find but again if you click on x plus y if you type error evaluate so debugging is always helpful okay here when you find here you won't be seeing that customized error message but what you can do you can just see here mule message right error dot mule message right evaluate it you can you here also again you won't be seeing anything but you can see something like typed value but instead if you do dot payload you can see your customized error message so this is the exact syntax if you want to get the exact customized error response that is coming from the system api or process api and if you want to propagate that particular error so you have to use this syntax error dot mule message dot payload it is very important and a very tricky one even if you are using dot payload you can see like when i evaluate error dot mule message i won't be seeing any payload here right so you can use dot payload or you can use again dot typed value evaluate it you can still so error dot mule dot mule message dot typed value is correct or error dot mule message dot payload is also correct so this is how you can propagate the error response now 